Hokey dokey. Second example for this problem, I will work through it a little bit faster. If you'd like more of a breakdown, please visit the first example I've worked out. So in this problem, we are looking for the segment on this graph with the greatest rate of change. In other words, the most positive or the steepest positive slope. So we can eliminate any negative sloped segments. So that just gets rid of those first two. So now the remaining uh, four segments are all positive. We are looking for the steepest one. So this first one is about like that. The next one is steeper than that one. So we can eliminate that uh, you know, first positive slope. And then between the remaining ones, it looks like this one is the steepest because after this one, they kind of level out a little bit more. So it looks like we can eliminate these two on the end. And the goal is to find the slope of the segment from here to here. So in order to find the slope of that segment, we need to use the slope formula, which is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So we're identifying first the ordered pairs of each of these two points. So the first one, let's say the x value is about 6.9. It's almost 7, not quite 7. So we'll say 6.9. And then it's just above 2 for its y value. So maybe 2.1, I think, is fair for the y value. As long as it's a close enough approximation, it should be good enough, adequate enough to get us the correct answer. So the x value for the second ordered pair looks like it is about 8.6, just past 8.5. And then the y value might be, it's just above that four line, but just barely, it's kind of still touching the line. So maybe I'll say 4.05, okay. So now we are plugging these values into the slope formula. 4.05 minus 2.1 all divided by 8.6 minus 6.9. All right, uh, 4.05 minus 2.1 is very close to 2, but the way I chose these points, it's a little, you know, it's not ideal, but we get 1.95 on top. And then on bottom, we have 8.6 minus 6.9. That should give us 1.7. All right, so now we will divide 1.95 divided by 1.7, and we get approximately 1.15. And so what we'll do is pick the closest answer to this one. So looking at our options, eliminating any negative ones, we see 1.1 as an answer. So that is hopefully our best choice here break out the eraser and we see that C is the correct answer.